Okay, I'm here again the uh, home tab of Autodesk Inventor. So today we'll be di uh, we'll discuss yung ano uh, again um, advanced fillet again. So this time uh, another method of using fillet, uh, which is have a variable reduce. Now um so let let's get started. So pwede rin naman nating gamitin ito to rather than using this one or using this one you can create uh, new okay or let's say I want to check if we are still in the project A so we can do that one so pwede naman lumipat you can double check on this one so automatically it reflects diba then we are still in the project A so you just press done then click new so makikita nyo dito we have part create 2D and 3D objects so we have assembly 2d and drawing and standard presentation okay so let uh, let's focus on the standard ipt and mapakita niya we have here your units uh, on uh, sa metric pa rin tayo so we have your units as a millimeter so i'm gonna press create Okay, so we are now on the uh, model space ng part. So again, I'm gonna expand the origin. I'm gonna click uh, to start to the sketch. So I will try to use this plane, the SJ plane, to create uh, to the sketch. Now I'm going to click a rectangle again. I'll say let's start. Draw na lang tayo ng square. Okay. Then I will make an auto dimension para auto para automatic na magkaroon tayo ng dimension niya and to uh, constrain yung ano natin ng ng ating drawing so clicking auto dimension apply okay done so then I'm gonna finish this one and I'm going to extrude so let's say again uh um, let's say 15 mm then I'm gonna click OK now going to fillet oh. so makikita nyo dyan we have constant and we have variable so I'm gonna click the variable so click click natin yung edge so from here makikita nyo we have start and end so for let's say for the starting I'm gonna change this one to let's say uh, 5 mm Okay. So, makapansin nyo yung effect doon sa, ano natin, sa object. So, and you can adjust it directly dito. No? Okay. Yeah. So, that is using yung uh, advanced fillet, uh, advanced fillet yung variable. Then, I'm gonna click apply. Okay. So, makapansin nyo we have the changes for this one. So, para makita natin, we go to uh, view and visual style. So, I'm gonna shade it one para my wire, wire print tayo nakikita. So, we have that one. Okay. So, you can explore uh, explore this one. Follow my steps. Then, okay. So, I'm gonna click OK and let's try more. Natin dyan. This time, we're going to apply at the end naman. So, let's say this is 4mm. Okay. So, usually, mostly yung applica application nito, mostly in, uh, are on uh, moldings, na mga mold molding designs. Okay. But you can also, add, depending on application din yung sa mga designs ninyo, yung mga projects na may encounter ninyo. Okay. Then click apply. So try din natin again dito. So we have your variable. Uh, dito naman tayo sa start. Okay, I can adjust one directly. Um, click apply. Okay. And also on this side, clicking the edge ng part na ito. Okay. So, pwede rin at the middle, so start end, or uh, or on the point. So, just clicking on the surface. So, you can adjust that one. So, 
ganun ka versatile na using this software okay then click apply okay let's escape or cancel that one so we have the home advanced fillet so that is how we're going to how we're going to use that advanced fillet or variable 